All right, guys. Welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption One. So in our last episode, uh, Dickens he mentioned Seth. He knows a guy, Seth, who might help us to get into the Fort Mercia, which I mean, in which Bill Williamson was, I think, staying. So I think this guy Seth used to carry some stuff to Fort. And maybe if we help this Seth, he could, you know, take us to the Fort Mercier, where we can, you know, assassinate Bill Williamson or capture him. Now, yeah, it's going great. And yeah, if you want to check out other episodes of this game, make sure you check the description where you will find a link to a playlist that has all the episodes of this game. Right, so... I heard the game play would be around uh, 10 to 10 and a half hours, 10 to 11 hours. So we could expect somewhere around 20, 20 episodes, which is uh, so much for the size of the game. Like First, I thought uh, maybe, I think this game was around 20 GB or 18 GB. For 18 GB, we are getting 20 plus hours. It's too much. Now, nowadays, all the games will only have, I mean, we only have around how much? Okay, we got ammo. Where are we? I don't know. Let's open the map and see if we are nowhere near. I mean, we are at the center for Dickens as well as Barney. But I'm gonna visit Barney because we haven't played a mission that was bonus. No, this was not my house, right? Mine was black. Yeah, so, oh, we got a bunch of, on, that could be a race or something. Let's go. Oh, that horse looks so pretty. Done, I think. Calm down now. Come on, baby. Calm down. Oh, and it's too much. Yeah, we finally got it. Yeah, I think we are at a McFarn Farms. McFarn Lane's Farms, yeah.
how this face Get him in there! Come on! Come on! Hey, miss! Hey, miss. I got most of the horses secure and the chicken. Well, thank you, Amos, but it's the herd I'm worried about. I know. They're scattered all over the valley and beyond. The weather is coming in real fast. So what do you suggest, Amos? We leave the herd out there to be scattered by the storm and ourselves left here to die without a livelihood? Can I help? No, miss. If the men get caught out in that storm, they're gonna die. And if we lose our herd, we'll all die, you stupid man. Doesn't sound like we're left with much of a choice, then. Come on, Amos. Round up your men. Let's get the herd. Dang. Let's get going before the weather gets any worse. Come on. That sky don't look good. I'm starting to think somebody up there is conspiring against me. Are you a religious man? Not in any real sense. Sometimes I tell myself things happen for a reason. Like what brought me here was the fake come so good for but nobody made my path for me. We all need to go crazy game. somewhere. Some in big old I don't know, books, maybe to the thirteen or something like that. Even in some kind of divine purpose ain't gonna give me my wife and kid back. Past is who we are, Miss McFarland. There ain't no change in that. Faith is a luxury I can't afford. We have two herds out grazing in different pastures. We'll need to merge them and bring them all back. I think we can handle that. The cows get real ornery in bad weather. It's more work, but I'll show you how to deal with them. I'm going to save my voice for the herd. It's going to be hard shouting over this storm. Oh, there are the cows. We can't afford to fall. Whoa there. Slow it up now. What the hell you are? No, 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 too far. Come on!
That's everything. You saved the herd back there. You might make a decent rancher one day. Thank you, Mr. Farmer. Oh, we got a bonnie mission yeah. right away. Hands have been out looking, but so far they've found nothing. Well, come on, let's go look for him. Thank you, Mr. Marston. I'm sure it's nothing, but I worry about the old fool. Come on. Yeah. I've got a bad feeling about this. It's not like him to be away for so long. Don't worry, we'll find him. He's not as young as he used to be. What if he's hurt himself? My father can still handle himself just fine, Miss McFarland. He built like an oak. You're probably right, but I can't help worrying. He's all I've got. Come on, boy. Don't you have any brothers or sisters, Miss McFarland? I had six brothers, but five hmm? of them died, six. either from sickness or foolish choices. And the other one? He left for the east and never came back. Must be getting on for ten years ago now. He's a high and mighty banker in New York, according to his last letter. He should be here, helping you and your pa. I don't want his help. He can live his life any way he wants. But when I see those city fellers coming in on the railway, all dressed up like a sore toe, I fear a little for his soul. He switched his saddle for a tie, and that's fine. I just never met a man in a tie I could trust. Look, I think I see someone. What? Daddy! What happened? Nothing nice. Wrestlers, I guess. Maybe the baller twins, that bunch. Now you head back to the ranch right now. Fetch the wagon. Yes, sir. Marston, you watch after her. I'll do that, sir. Hey! What could have happened to those poor men? And their horses were dead, too. I think we should get back there as soon as we can. Who could have done something like that? Your boss seemed to have an idea who it was. Let's just do what he says and get the wagon. So open your goddamn eyes. I don't think that's a good idea. And you're no better. How many men have you killed? Do you really want to know? It's disgusting. You never met the men I killed. I heard the way you talk about that gang you were in. Like there was some twisted morality <laughs> to what you did. We all have a code. Only some of us don't realize. The outlaw with the code? How wonderfully romantic. The reluctant murderer, the noble criminal. There's nothing more depressing than a man who's found a way to think the bad into good. You're upset, Miss... Look, Mr. Marston, the barn is on fire. Yeah! Uh, okay. Yeah! Oh, 
Oh, on the other side, okay. Oh, we have to move, okay. What? Uh, we still got one house left, right? I mean, who might have done this? I don't see any sure enemies for thanks, Martin. Yes, Farland. Thanks. You, well, you saved the ranch. If you'll excuse me, I, I've got chores to attend to. Hey, ho hold on a second over there. Sincerely, John. Thank you. Well, did all I could, Miss McFarland. Sorry about all the damage. That gang seems to really want you out of here. Yeah, well, my father fought Indians. I scarcely think we're going to be frightened by some white trash. White trash can be pretty frightening. Well, they don't frighten me. Good. John, my family owes you a great debt. I think you got enough debt. You saved my life. All I ask of you is this. If I get back home and get my farm started back up, you'll sell me some cattle. I prefer doing business with people I know. Of course, Mr. Marston. It'd be my pleasure. Um, well, you get some rest. I've got to go see how my father's bearing up. Not even one photo, okay. What the? And that was. Okay, I think we got Seth, we got uh, Marshall Johnson. Oh, we got a lot of missions. I think we could just do one another mission, I think. Oh, uh, we Marshall Johnson will be a lot of firing, so I will choose Seth. Let's choose first. Seth, we don't have only 10 minutes. So,
Oh, he's taking graves again. Hey, John. You got the map, Hi, right? You what you need? You ready to help me? Not quite. Not quite ready. You see, I wasted a bunch of time looking for that last bit of map. And I got to thinking, Moses was a liar. Hmm? And I imagined myself doing all kinds of unpleasant things to his corpse. <laughs> and then I realized... Realized you were sick in the head? That you needed to move on with your own limited time on Earth? No, partner. I realized Moses were no liar. The <laughs> issue was Aiden O'Leary, who said he had the body. Aiden died in that flu epidemic, and the bodies weren't even buried yet. <laughs> you got the body sitting in the back of that wagon behind you? Yes, sir. <laughs> You're not even going to wait until they're buried before you... <laughs> well, they don't care, do you, boys? Honest folk, off to a better place. Apart from that Aiden O'Leary fella, I never liked him. They say he lay with his sister. I don't like women, partner. I don't. Not since Mammy died. Seth, what are you going to do with those bodies? <sighs> I'm going to take him back to a nice, quiet spot and look for the map. I need the map, partner. I need it. Let's go. We ain't the only ones with an interest in these here fellers. Can't wait to get my hands on these. Find some place quiet near Tumbleweed. I got a feeling the treasure's around there somewhere. Come on. Stay left. No need for the people of Armadillo to see my friends back here. Where are you? Come on, don't be shy. What did you say? I didn't say nothing. Are you talking to them? <laughs> so what if I am? I feel less alone with them than in a crowd of people. The way I see it, they lost their soul, just like me. You're truly a sick man, Seth. You remind me of why I hate people. For a man who kills so much, you sure seem to have a problem with the dead. Life kills everyone in the end. <laughs> They ain't so different from you and me. Besides from them being dead and rotting, I guess they ain't. All right, Seth, calm down. You talk to the corpses and I'll drive the wagon. They're coming after us. Get us what? out of here. I'm going to look for the map back here. You try to shake those damn rednecks. Oh, I got this. this. I didn't... Oh, yeah. I got a lot this of people. Too many glitches, guys. Be over soon. Well, look at this. Some elixir. All done with this one. Oh, he's throwing bodies. I thought they were glitched.
gonna be wreaked beyond my wildest dreams. Maybe then you can take a back. Thanks, mister. I reckon I'll sit here a while trying to figure this out. I'm gonna be rich. When you're done with that, get over to Fort Mercer. I need you inside that place. After I find my treasure, mister. Oh, what else? We got Seth right here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna stop here and I'm gonna do the Seth mission which is so close to me right now in the next episode and if you want to check out those episodes make sure you check the description where you will find a link to a playlist that has all the episodes of this game until next episode keep watching and bye bye